Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another makeup look or makeup routine style video. Today we're going to be doing the famous TikTok light makeup filter look. Before we start, I just want to say I'm not a makeup or beauty guru. I just thought this would be a fun makeup look to do and to try. And I also want to say before we start that I am emphasizing this look based off of a TikTok filter. But that being said, please keep in mind this is a filter. Not everything you see on social media is real. But this filter filter is a light makeup filter, which is kind of a fun inspo makeup look that I wanted to try today. So anyways, we are going to try and do this makeup look. Before we get started, if you guys are new here, it would mean so much to me if you took the time to like and subscribe. I'm a small channel, but we are growing every single day and I would love for you guys to follow along with me on this channel. Before we start, we are going to pull up the filter so we can get a good before and after and just kind of see what we have to base this look off of. I'm gonna get my phone and we're gonna pull up TikTok. Okay, so we are on the light makeup look right now and we're going to click use this effect. So this is before with no filter on. We're gonna take a photo so we can try and compare what the before and after is like. Okay, so there's one and then we're gonna put the filter on. And now that the filter's on, we're gonna take another screenshot so we can try and see what we have to do to recreate this look. Okay, and let's go. Starting off, we're just going to put on a little bit of milk makeup primer just to try and make this look stay and last all day. It is summertime, it's hot outside. Usually my makeup melts off my face, so we're gonna put some of that on. So you can tell this filter there is a very even complexion. So we're gonna start by putting on some concealer. If you guys know, I love this Merit Concealer Foundation Stick, the smallest amount and put it over any blemishes. It works just like a concealer and a foundation in one stick. Rolls on like butter. You can just put a small bit all over your face. And then I'm going to take my Kabuki brush and just blend it in. It blends in super easy and I think it's just a lot lighter than wearing foundation. Blend it into our neck a little bit. Okay, and now we have our base for our makeup. Looking at the look next, we're going to do our eyebrows. I don't think the filter actually changes your eyebrows too much. I'm just gonna fill mine in the tiniest bit. Fill them in the inner corner. Let's see here, and like that. Like that. Yeah, it really doesn't look like they fill or do too much to the brows. So we are going to just touch them up a tiny, tiny bit. There's a little bit for the brows. Now going back. So I think what makes this look the look that it is, is it's very heavy on contour and blush. So that's what we're gonna try right now. We're going to try and do the contour and blush that they have in this filter because I think that's what really makes your skin or underneath your eyes and above your nose pop. Contour wise, we're gonna do a swipe here and a swipe here. I think this filter actually changes your chin to make it smaller and your nose to slightly make it smaller. We're obviously not going to be doing that for today's look. The contour shading is supposed to give it that look as well. So we're gonna try that. We're gonna put a little bit on our chin here and then also on our forehead. And then we're gonna try and do this on our nose. So it looks like the filter puts it on your nose like that. <laughs> Up your normal bridge. Under your nose like this, I think. Like I said, guys, I am not a beauty guru. I literally don't think I knew how to do my makeup until like first year of university. I used to just wear like mascara in high school. So we are learning. It's a work in progress. Okay. It honestly looks a bit bronzed, like even in a little bit. So I'm gonna bring it in like this and see how that looks. I know this is not how you're supposed to put contour on, but we're just trying to recreate this filter. So 
we'll give this a shot. And then we're going to blend this in. I don't even know if this is my color. I don't think it is. That's with the big brush. <laughs> now we're gonna try the smaller angled brush to try and do our nose and blend this in our face a bit more. Now we're gonna go over with a slightly different contour shade. I feel like this gave me a bronze look, not the dramatic contour look that's in this video. So we're gonna go over it with a little more contour. I really hit pan on this palette. I'm just trying to get the most out of it. This might be the most bronzed I've ever bronzed myself. Now we're gonna take this color on the Kat Von D pan and just go over the nose again. Oh my god, this looks so funny. <laughs> okay, blend, 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 blend. Okay. Do we look airbrushed or do we look airbrushed? I also can't tell if I look as crazy as how I'm looking at myself in the camera right now because of how the lighting is when I'm looking into it. I don't know. I guess we'll see afterwards. Now we are going in with the blush. There's super heavy blush in this filter. So we are going to put some here. Here. Oh, this is also the Merit Flesh Balm in the color Cheeky. It is so nice. It's probably the nicest blush I've ever had. Put some excessive blush. Then we are going to blend, 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 blend. Now that that is blended in, I think we're gonna put on even a little more blush just to really, just to really make sure that our cheeks are popping like they do with this filter. So we're going to put on some on our nose and then all the way up on our cheekbone to give us that flushed, flushed look. Okay, there we go. I feel like we look bronzed and blushy. So let's keep going. Okay, next to this filter, it looks like there's definitely highlight on this part of the cheeks the bridge of the nose, the tip of the nose, the chin. So we're gonna try and highlight those areas. This is the Cover FX Moonlight Highlighter. I've been using this bottle for probably like three or four years. It has lasted so long and it's my favorite highlighter. So we are going to put this on our nose, the bridge of our nose. We're gonna do our cheekbones. And then we're also gonna do like in here because that's where the filter has it. <laughs> okay. And then a bit on our chin, a little under the eyebrow. Okay. Let's blend this all in. Okay, and there is the highlighter blended out. Now we're gonna go on to the eyes. So this light makeup look has very wispy eyes. So usually I do eyeliner, but I think for this look, I'm going to do eyeshadow and a thin brush and try and do an eyeshadow wing. I don't do this a lot, so I don't know how this is gonna work, but we're gonna use our Tarte palette and we're going to use the color Artist and try and do some wings. I don't know if that's a good start or not. <laughs> It looks like there's a bit of eyeshadow all throughout the eye, but it's super thin, except at the end, so. Oh, I poked myself in the eye. There's one eye, kind of. Depending how this look turns out, I might need to redo my makeup after. Okay, I don't know how these are looking. I don't know if that's how the filter looks, <laughs> but we're gonna go with it because this is us trying, not necessarily succeeding. Fix those up a tiny bit. Okay, let's see. Ah, we're getting there. Now, looking at the filter, even if I put mascara on, my lashes will not look how they look in this filter. So I'm gonna put on some falsies. I have some Demi Wispies I'm gonna try and put on, and we'll see how this looks. Blah, blah, blah. Maybe these weren't demi or wispy enough. 
I can't tell. Okay, I think that went on okay. I can't really tell. I think I got glue in my eye and I might be blind in this eye right now. <sighs> we're gonna roll with it, cause we're almost done. Now looking at the look, I feel like we're almost done. I feel like I need like a bit of shine, a bit more shine. So I'm gonna put this Merit highlighting balm like in my forehead, <laughs> like here. <laughs> and a bit more on my chin and just inside here, just to make it glow. You know, this is light makeup. That's what the filter says, guys. I don't know about that. Last but not least, I think we have the lips to do. I think the filter gives like a dark liner on your lips to make them look fuller. We don't have that, but I think we have some lip liner. So let's take a look here. Ah, yes. MAC lip liner. My old friend. I don't think I've used this since like grade 12 when Kylie started coming out with her lip kits. We're going to try and do just around our lips and blend it in. So we'll see how this looks. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try and blend it out a little bit. It looks like super dark around the top, so I'm gonna like try and really emphasize the liner on the top. Okay guys, and even though we're close to being done, I think I still need more nose contour. Like I'm just looking and I think we need more. So we're gonna put a little more on. We'll do our best to blend. And I think that's it. I think this is the final look for trying to recreate the light makeup filter look. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I definitely don't think that this is a light makeup look. Feels like a lot of contour, a lot of blush. The lips actually turned out a bit better too than I thought they would. And now the moment of truth, we are going to try and see what this makeup look looks like on actual TikTok. Okay, so we have the filter on right now, and now we're gonna take it off and see what it looks like. So let's go to filter, oops, okay. Okay, so we're gonna go to filter, turn it off, and that's what it looks like. I mean, it's not perfect, but I feel like it's still pretty close. I feel like putting the filter on just, you know, emphasizes what we've already done. So it takes this light filter to a medium filter for makeup. Um, but yeah, overall, I think we did a uh, seven out of 10 job. That's how I feel. <laughs> I feel like we did, we did our best. But anyways guys, this is gonna be everything for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new here, it would mean so much to me if you took the time to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye.